Hey guys, we've got the Crystal Lux XHP50 LED fog lights here for the F-150. These are a pretty easy install, simple upgrade. They're an H10 fog light, which is what you get on pretty much any F-150 these days. So they're plug and play, come with the ballast and everything. They have about a 12,000 lumen output and a 6,500K color temperature. So they're gonna be a little bit brighter, a little bit more of a clean white color than the yellow that you normally have from factory. If you like this video and you wanna see more installs and reviews like this, go ahead and just hit that subscribe button below to keep up with all of our videos that we're putting out and go ahead and follow us on Instagram for any daily updates or other photos regarding our builds. So we're gonna go ahead and get these installed right now. For our access point to the fog lights, we need to remove the two fender liner bolts near the bumper along with a threaded plastic clip which is closer to the front suspension. Now we can peel back the liner enough to get to the light and the housing. In this photo here, you'll see the alignment screw and the spring assembly. You'll need to remove that screw and the spring so that we can remove the fog light housing from the bumper, then unplug the light from the harness. To remove the fog light from the bumper, grab some trim tools and wedge them on the sides of the light housing. The light is clipped in on each side and some inward pressure with the trim tool will help to release the clips and pop it out. Now remove the factory halogen lamp by twisting it out of the housing. The new light will take some finesse to squeeze it into the housing, and the metal clips on the light bulb and the plastic clips on the housing can give you kind of a hard time. Plug in the ballast and tighten the locking ring. Now the light assembly can be placed back into the bumper. The light will insert through the front and simply push back into the two side clips that hold it. To tidy up behind the bumper, you can plug in the harness to the bulb and zip tie the ballast and extra slack in the wiring. Lastly, reinstall the alignment screw and spring. How much you tighten it will determine the angle of the fog light, so be sure to get each side even and pointed low enough not to blind oncoming drivers. The plastic clip and both screws can be replaced into the fender liner to complete the installation. We're out here now on kind of a back road outside of Phoenix, and this is sort of the ideal place to use these bulbs. It's gonna be dark areas, you know, dimly lit country roads, even off-road just to give you that additional boost in light. These are gonna be a little bit brighter than what you get normally from a factory, just H10 bulb that comes with this truck. And the output is really nice too if you have LED headlights or something with a brighter, whiter color to it. This is gonna match that a lot better, uh, as opposed to, you know, having the mix match of yellow and white colored lights. But overall, we do really like the way that these look on our truck and the way they perform. 